Hello, detailers, you watch an economic calendar presented to you by InstaForex News team and me, Kate Nidachina. Investors will watch closely the following macroeconomic data in the early half of the week. China will release its trade balance data for January on Tuesday. According to analysts, a trade surplus of $24.2 billion is expected. In December, China's trade surplus fell to $25.6 billion from $33.8 billion. Since the increase in December, exports failed to meet anticipations. Experts predict a trade surplus at $32.15 billion in December. Chinese shipments rose 4.3% in December versus a 5% expected increase. Meanwhile, in November, they indicated advanced 12.7%. At the same time, imports increased 8.3% on yearly basis against a 5% rise anticipated by analysts. Next, Switzerland will disclose its inflation report. According to analysts, January Consumer Price Index is seen to post a 0.2% decline from December and slightly rise by 0.1% annually. In the previous months, there were similar dynamics. Thus, consumer prices advanced by 0.2% months over months and climbed by 0.1% on yearly basis in December. That was the second consecutive increase in the annual reading. In November, the indicator rose for the first time in more than two years. In 2013, Switzerland's consumer inflation came in at minus 0.2%, although it it was 0.7% in 2012. In addition, Eurostat is about to release its December industrial production report. Preliminary estimates project the indicator to rise an annualized 1.8 percent. However, a monthly basis of the Eurozone's industrial output is seen to decline 0.2 percent. It was noting that the indicator rose at its fastest pace in three and a half years in November, rising 1.8 percent on months and 3 percent on year, and thus contributing to the euro area's GDP growth estimates. The data topped experts' forecasts. November's monthly industrial production grew at the quickest pace from May 2010 and posted its uh, fastest annual growth rate from August 2011. It was economic calendar on InstaForex TV channel. Have a nice trading week.